the farm, and today he's paying her a visit. I'm up near Kidderminster, where I'm checking in on my Suffolk Punch horse, Lexi. She's staying on this stud farm here for a little while, and I'm hoping, with everything crossed, that she'll be in foal very soon. Lexi's had a tough time of it since I bought her more than a year ago. It started so well. Wonderful she's in fall. When's she due? She's actually due end of April, early May. It's exciting, isn't it? The Suffolk Punch is an incredibly rare breed, with only about 80 viable females in the UK. So I was excited to have Lexi start her family back on my farm. But things didn't work out that way. Last April, it ended up very sadly for Lexi and her foal. Lexi went into labour a week early. Her foal was born with underdeveloped lungs, and despite the best efforts of the vet, the foal didn't make it. It was so sad losing a little foal, and I felt so sorry for Lexi. But here at Hole Beach Stud Farm, where they specialise in the Suffolk Punch breed, I'm hoping things will work out better for Lexi, particularly as this was the farm she was born on seven years ago. So she's back amongst her family. Whole Beach is run by Mike Clark and his daughter Alison. And they've both known Lexi since she was a foal. Hi, Mike. Hi, Hi Alison. Hi, Adam. This is a handshake, yeah? <laughs> so where's Lexi now? She's at the top of the yard. Do you want to go and have a look? Love to, thank go you. On. The Suffolk Punch may be rare now, but they used to be a common sight on farms across the country. Mike and Alison are trying to build the breed back up with a very natural, no-frills approach, which has certainly worked with this new arrival they've had on the farm. I hope it works for Lexi, too. It's so lovely to see so many Suffolk horses all together, isn't it? Oh, yeah. It's quite a sight. And everybody comments on the horses and the view behind. I can see why. They're magnificent. Mike and Alison currently have a whopping 30 Suffolk punches on the farm. I've never seen so many in one place before. And have you got the biggest herd in the country, Mike? Biggest tribe. Biggest yeah, tribe. tribe. Yeah. Amazing. Well, it's every day's a school day. And where's Lexi? Um, she's round the back of the feeder with her mum and her sister. How's she settled in then, Alison? Oh, fine. It's like she's never been away. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can recognise Lexi by her mane, which is darker than the other horses. And she has a little white star on her forehead. So can we go in and take a closer look? Of course you can. Yep. Thank you. She's wandered off. Right in the back of the feeder, I think, Adam. Back home, Lexi can sometimes be a bit nervous. But it seems like it's a different story today. Oh, there she is round yeah, there. She's so relaxed, isn't she? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she is, yeah. I mean, she's no problem at all. I don't, you know, I don't know what you do with her in her, her old place, but she's fine here, like so. Mike's down to earth.